Okay. Hello everyone. This time I'm not doing anything like even a stream intro or something. Can someone please tell me why this game always, always updates on a Monday? <laughs> I swear they're doing that just to fuck with me. Oh my god, fucking finally. Also, I read the patch note. It's only bug fixes. If this is an 8 gigabyte bug fix. 9 gigabyte bug fix patch. Holy shit. But we finally made it. Only 15 minutes late. Hello everyone. So good to see you. Welcome back to Mass Effect. I just wanted to get like two, two and a half hours of Mass Effect this wonderful evening to relieve my stress after work. Hey, Koma, good to see you. But of course they had to fucking update the game on a fucking Monday again. That's the second time. I guess that's just when they roll out patches for this game. What did we do uh, want to do? We did some um, assignments, some um, side quests last time. Um, now... I think I want to do Pharaohs, which is the last one of like the three main quests that we got in the beginning. And before Vermeer, I don't even know if we're going to do Vermeer today. It really depends on how quick things are going. I want to do some some more uh, side quests just to be prepared. Um, but let's go to Pharaohs. Why the colony was attacked by Gath. I don't really remember Pharaohs. Like, Vermeer I have very vague memories about. But Pharaohs, that doesn't, that doesn't mean jack shit to me. <laughs> yeah, thanks for noticing, but it's always a bit late. Hey, but at least it's working. Pharaohs. The Exo Exogeny Corporation has founded a pilot colony on Pharaohs to explore the Prothean ruins that blanket two thirds of the planet's landmass. The atmosphere is fouled with dust. Terrestrial travel is hampered by crumbled debris dozens of meters deep. There are indicators that Pharaohs was a much colder world in the past. Pharaohs has two large moons Orkan, the father, and uh, the farther and vard it. Uh, sure, land. How was work? <coughs> it was okay. Um, nothing special, but... Um, it wasn't, like, insanely stressful. The two interns are still a lot, and I only had them, like... I had no help with them today, and still had to do everything else. So it was a bit much, but it, it worked out in the end. Let's go. I just want to get through this week um, with them because it's like my main help with our... Uh, with my one co-worker is gone because she's uh, she's on holiday break and I am the intern handler I've always been the intern handler as long as I work there I do the most with the interns it says like that uh, the the person responsible for the interns is my boss but I think my boss has talked like it has said like three sentences combined to both of them. Rex and Garrett, let's accept our squad, obviously. Equalizing Look at the boys. Interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Um, what they did without me, they would just do the same thing, like with every single intern. They would just. Okay, there we go. You are switching on our, on your own. That's very nice. 
Um, they would just give them like a um, a handheld recording, uh, a, a handheld recorder, and pretty much just shove them off into the city to like do some quest to just question some some uh, passerbys and then fill that together and um, make basically like a 30 minute show around that and that's the, o the only thing like both of my co-workers like my main co-workers they for all they do they have like one strategy and one thing that they do But hey, on Thursday, I will write, hopefully, a very, like, a job application for a job that I would actually really, 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 really want to do. Uh, so wish me luck with that. And I realized today that I don't have a three-month notice period, as I thought, like, three months between handing in my, my, uh, my leaving notice and stop working there, which is standard, but I only have six weeks. That... I really like learning that. Your ship. Fidan wants to speak with you immediately. Who? I? What? Who in the what now? Who's Fidan? He's our leader. He needs your help to prepare for the Geth. They are making another push. Please, up the stairs past the freighter. Oh! My god, they fucking annihilated him! Poor bastard. Oh, there. That guy just got fucking shrieked. Wait. Why are all my quick slots gone? <laughs> fucking patch. No fungus talk here. Oh, and singularity and throw and unity and yeah, I guess the shield boost. But shrooms. Take this. Um. Okay, interesting. Oh, there's a fucking sniper! No! Oh, it's already dead. Because I have a sniper myself! <laughs> oh no, not you again. Yeah, I'm... I think it would be a cool opportunity... Oh my god, he's just hanging there. It would be a pretty cool opportunity with that job. I was just browsing because originally I, I only wanted to, like, look from August onward. Um... To look for a new job, but... I just decided out of a whim, because it's been so much lately, that I just want to check something now. And I found this one application that I really, really enjoyed and that I would absolutely love to do. So I'm going to do that on, on Thursday. Yes, that's so. Who are you? You have a name. Oh, okay. You also have a name. Mahadoil. All of these had names, but none of them have, like, really talked to me. <laughs> I fear the Geth will kill us all. The Geth are mounting another attack. Let me just, uh, steal your shit then. <laughs> 
While decrypting these logs, he found something suspicious. Several months worth of human rations were delivered to an uncharted world in the Voyager cluster. The logs aren't clear, but it appears that maybe they maybe have been dropped off somewhere in the Amazon system. That's not a system, that's a river. Oh, there's Phidon. Still have to talk to him, I guess. Okay. How was your Monday so far, everyone? I hope it was uh, not as work heavy as mine. I'm glad they finally sent somebody to help us. You're a bit late, aren't you? Arcelia. Sorry, Commander. Everyone's on edge since. Watch out! We've got gas in the tower! Protect the heart of the colony! Protect the who and the what now? Oh my god, my health! At least now I survive. Uh, a shot from a sniper at full health and full shield with like one HP. Oh my god. Those are some quick snipers. You wrote some applications. That's awesome. I hope we both have uh, success with our endeavors. Okay, that's a sh nope, that's a sniper. Come on. Fuck off. Oh my god, Rex scared me. What? Oh my god, hello. Could you maybe not do that? These shields are so obnoxious. Stairs down to the tunnels. Stop Geth in tower, okay. Oh, hello! I hate the sound of sniper rifle now. Even though it's most of the time it's just Garrus. It's just like my own my own helper. Oh, what are you? Fucking wrecking drones. Oh, there's that guy just casually walked up. Nice. Oh, wait, there's more. I don't like the name Destroyer. Wait, where the fuck even is Rex? Oh, 
always back there. He's behind the fucking door. He's behind the door. He can't come out. He can't come in here. I mean, now, I guess? After this cutscene? Nine gigabyte patch, by the way. Should update Fidan on the situation before we move on to wherever the Geth are bunker. He's the closest thing left to proper channel. Ah, there he is. Hey, missed the fight? Ah, good sir. What did you apply for, Semi? Or do you not want to say? That would be totally understandable. Tower secure. Thanks to you, Commander. I'm just glad your colony is safe. I mean, safe. I appreciate your concern and your efforts against the Geth. They may have been slowed, but they'll be back. They always come back. What do they want? If you want answers, go ask them yourselves. We don't know what they're after. They came, they attacked us, that's all we know. Their main base is at the Exogeny headquarters. A good place to start looking if you want answers. What's Exogeny? It's the company what? most of us work for before the attack. <laughs> I again got tapped out because I got an achievement. The Skyway leads Fucking hell. directly to Exogeny headquarters. You can't miss it. Of course, there's an army of Geth between here and there. Yes. No problem. I didn't expect this would be easy. Then maybe I can get this colony operational again. What can you tell me about the defenses the Geth have set up? I don't have any details, but I'll wager it's a lot more fortified than the command post. They landed at least one Geth ship at Exogeny, and I've seen large walking tanks on the Skyway. Whoa. Expect a hard fight. That's not that great, uh, uh, actually. Just for some so uh, just for some shops around here. I mean, that's cool. Oh, oh my god. I can't speak today. That's pretty cool. What do you need done to get this place I hope you get one speed. of them. We need those Geth destroyed. Arcelia's right. There are still Geth in the tunnels. We also have more mundane problems like food, water, and power. I'm not yeah, sure hey, headshot. On those matters. They always... The people overseeing them. Always patch this game on a Monday, which is infuri infuriating. Um, but it was actually pretty... Pretty okay. It was like 9 gigabytes and it was like 12 minutes for me to download it. Is there anything I can do to solve your water shortage? Maka Doyle has been assigned to that particular issue. If you have any insight to offer... Oh, I can't just talk... Oh, I can't just talk to all of these What's people. wrong with the colony's power supply? May O'Connell is working on our power problems. She'd know more about it than I do. You mentioned something about a food shortage. Davin Reynolds is tasked with securing food for the immediate future. If you can assist, please speak with him. I'll talk to you when sure. I learn more. Good luck, Commander. Let's talk to these wonderful colonizing people. You'll have to forgive my wife. Kalantha's not in her right mind. She just needs to relax and accept what's happened. Ah, uh, what? <laughs> what happened to your wife? The constant attacks have strained us all. She'll adapt. We all have. Is that Alan Rickman? That sounds like Alan Rickman or someone doing a. Honestly, not that bad Alan Rickman impression. Is there anything I can do for her? No, she just needs time. Time to absorb everything. We'll be fine. Well, now he actually didn't sound like Alan Rickman at all, so I don't, I don't actually know. Tell me about the colony. Maybe I'm just tired. I can't tell you much about that. You'd best ask by Dan if you really must know. Yeah, okay. I have to go. Just don't talk to me. Give me my level up. What do I want? I guess more basic armor for now. I can get more barrier. Garrus can get more electronics and decryption. Sure. Sounds good. Agreeable. You're the one who repelled that last wave. 
They'll be back. And if the Geth don't kill us, we'll die of hunger soon enough. Are you doing anything to remedy the situation? I need to boost rations with Baron meat, but it's too dangerous. Mm, delicious. The Alpha Bear, he's huge and he's mad. Rabbit meat. Totally uncontrollable. And probably delicious. I can't do anything until he's dead. Tell me about hunting Varen. Hunting them is impossible while fending off the Geth. On the positive side, they'll attack anything, even those damn synthetics. <laughs> the big Alpha Varen is the real problem. He's mad, erratic, completely unpredictable. I have a ship. I could bring in supplies from off-world. I'd rather you concentrated on the Geth. Food won't help us if they breach our defenses. Yeah, okay. I have to go. So long, Commander. Hey, Duo. Good to see you. How have you been? Work with those Geth. Glad you showed up. I still need the power cells for this generator, though. Would it help if I brought in some power cells from the Normandy? We can certainly spare a few. The top of the line ship doesn't use the same parts as the old generator we've got. The cells just aren't compatible. If I find anything while I'm looking around, I'll send it your way. Thank you, Commander. I sure, some power cells, some Varen killing. Sorry, but I can't stop to talk. I have to deal with the water shortage. Is there anything I can do? The utilities building was one of the first to fall under Geth control. Find the mains and turn them back on. Until then, this colony is dry. <laughs> do it yourself. Yeah, sure. I have to go. I wish you luck. Do you have something? You also have a name. Well, I, I guess you don't care. Drinking coffee and enjoying this cloudy weather while it lasts. It's been a scorcher? Yeah, preach. Wait. Oh, find- oh, find the Geth. Wait, won't. Well, no, this is, uh, second like main Ferris. Use your vehicle to make your way to the Exogeni headquarters and investigate the Geth activities. Do you have something else for me? Commander, what can I do for you? What can you tell me about the defenses? No, I already I don't have any details. They landed at least one Geth. Yeah, yeah uh, that's that's fine by me. Stairs down to the tunnel. I don't actually know where to go. Elevator to Prothean Skyway. I think that's part of the main quest. Maybe let's go to the tunnels, see what's up there. I, I, I remember this architecture, but I have no clue what this mission entails. I don't remember at all. Oh God, they're God, I hate these so much. There we go. I mean, Garrus, once Garrus fucking switches to his sniper rifle that I picked out for him, he actually does a shit ton of damage. Geth Transmitter. Collapse Highway Section. Rocket! Oh, here's the freaking. Wait, what was it? I saw the words water valve. Oh, up there, okay. This valve looks like part of a large system. There are likely others we need to activate as well. I hope I didn't already miss one. <laughs> Yep, I already missed one. Doesn't look like it's on yet. We should keep looking. 
Mass Effect speedrun on base. Mass Effect speedruns. Um, like classic Mass Effect 1 speedruns. Actually kind of fun. Oh, there they are. Hey. Which ones have used the alpha? Oh my god, there are so many of them. That's exactly the one that you also missed. Nice. Oh, that's the alpha. Hey, alpha. Do you care about gravity? Actually, please fuck off. I'm, I'm afraid of you. Okay. <laughs> the Varon falls dead, riddled with slugs. Tasty. This must be the alpha male, the pack leader of these feral scavengers. Nice. We got that done. Surviving, finally. You finally bought some materials to do some computer work. You just need a video editing program. That's pretty sweet, actually. Uh, I use DaVinci Resolve sludge canister um, for the little bit of editing that I usually do. Oh, power cells also. And it works perfectly fine. It's, uh, it's a free version of um, of a more known uh, all of like a professional program that's I think just called Da Vinci Da Vinci Studio or something like that I can definitely recommend it it's it's really easy to use it's uh, free and I I do not have any any complaints about it Geth transmitter. How do I get? Oh, I can just walk over there. Uh, let me go here first. Hey guys. Hey guys. <laughs> oh, it's with the fucking rockets. I'm so afraid of another rocket. Where are my dudes? Why am I alone again? Where is everyone? <laughs> Guys? What the fuck? Nice rocket again, dude. Just head on. Oh my god. Yes, please. Oh, it's a secret. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh. I can shoot him through this. Okay, that's way easier. Wow, that was frustrating. I think that... Hey, that's super nice of you to let me know that. Mind telling me over here? Bastard. Nine gigabyte patch, by the way. Still, everyone gets stuck. Who's that? You don't want to go down there. What are you doing down here? Nothing I should be. Anything I shouldn't. 
Wop. That was a good one. Very intense. What? I'm top tier husbando material? I don't know about that. What's the matter with you? Just invoking the master's whip. Please don't talk about your master's whip. I'm still alive. You're here for the geth, aren't you? You're not the only one interested in those things. Who else is looking for the geth? Not looking for. Looking to get rid of. They're a thorn in the side of the- <laughs> What the fuck? Let's go. He can't help us. Is there anything I can do to help you? Do you even want help? Help me? No. No one can help me now. What's up with that, dude? I don't even know. I'd rather die fighting. Fighting what? Not that kind of fight. It's like running through a thorn bush. The more you struggle, time's up. Company's coming. Ask Vidan. Ask him about the. Ah! Look out. Hey, Fidan, I was, uh. I, I was told to ask you about the. Ah! Can you tell me anything about that? No? Rad. Well, he's still alive, so. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay, dude. It's okay. Oh wait, where the fuck am I going? Guys, not again, please. Yeah, the castle of Oh, fucking hell no. Yep, that was the rocket. Thank you, Dor, for taking that for me. <laughs> Idiot. I got some new equipment, right? I got some new tungsten rounds, I think. Also, maybe a better pistol. Actually, the Stinger 5 is pretty good. Oh my god, what is this? A little less accurate, but fucking hell, that's so much more damage. Wait, am I using incendiary? No, I'm using... Wait, huh? I'm using these. Yeah, okay. Fields evil. Oh, hello, assault drone. Oh, you want to kill me? Oh, it has way less. Oh, no, it has way less. Um, I got so confused. It has way less um, frequent like it, it, it shoots way less frequent that's what I want to say wow I struggled with that sentence so much It 
It has a lower rate of fire. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Hatchot. I was so struggling. <laughs> Man, I wish my compadres would come and help me. Bastards. No! My face, please! Yeah, I should be able to command them, you're right. But I don't think that would help. I'm, I'm trying it now. I didn't even think about it. They're just not moving from that spot. There, I can still see them! It looks like he's fucking waving at me! Take back. Nine gigabyte patch, by the way. I will be saying this a lot today. Hey, sir. Fuck off. <laughs> that was that was actually kind of cool. Ooh. What are proton rounds? Oh, shield bypass. Shield bypass is also really good. Chameleon tool. Oh, and I think that's a better medical interface. Yeah. Garrus, do you need another... I guess so. Out for some Krogan fanfiction. Do I need to blow you up? Oh, I do. Okay. I mean, realistically, only I deserve this level up. Fuck you guys. Fine, you get a level up too. But only because I'm nice. Only because I'm a nice dude. What? Well, I heard that. Oh no. No! Oh, my. Wait. Why is this gone from my bar? Okay, thank you. What? Why can't I shoot? I can't shoot. No, I can. I think I have to get a new mouse. My mouse is like... Slowly dying on me. Yeah, Koma, what is it? I already asked what's it. What's up?
You know what? I don't... I regret that I ask. <laughs> I regret that I ask. I think my mouse is like slowly dying on me. I had this mouse for like... F almost 10 years at this point. And it was, even back then, it was like a somewhat cheap mouse. I think it was still the most expensive mouse that I ever bought, but it was from a relatively like budget company, uh, Speedlink, and I think it was like 35 bucks. Maybe it's time for a new one. Any inspiration for a new one? You mean... Wait, is that even where I want to go? No, it isn't. You mean if, if uh, you should give me some inspiration? I'd love to, because I have no clue. Again, I have... I bought this mouse 10 years ago, and that's the last time I bought a mouse. Why am I- am I not using a controller for this game? This is a shooter. At its core. And I will not succumb to the sickness that is playing a shooting game with a controller. I grew up playing Counter-Strike and Quake 3 and Battlefield 1942 all competitively and I I just can't. I I hate playing shooters with a controller. I hate it so much. Commander, what can I do for you? I destroyed a Geth transmitter in the tunnels. It won't be a problem any longer. Thank you, Commander. <laughs> the sickness, yeah. You've taken a or a base that would be hell. I just wish I had such good news for every problem. Is there anything I can do oh, to right. solve your problem? Oh right, after the yeah, yeah. Has been assigned to that particular issue. If you have any insight, I'll talk to you when I learn more, more Commander. I would like buttons for the thumb i mean i will just look uh for things myself eventually anyway i can't really i also can't show you my mouse it's a cable mouse so i can't like really hold it up that's like the, oh actually the cable goes pretty far and there are like there are two buttons here for the uh for the thumbs and that's all the special things i have it has it does have that's what I think was pretty cool, uh, but I think that's standard for like better mi uh, computer mice. I can like redo and like change the uh, the DPI and the general sensitivity like with buttons directly on the mouse, and I really like that. Um, I don't really need that much more buttons like two for the thumbs at least would be pretty cool maybe three but i don't need like seven or seven extra buttons i like cable bound um but for mice i'm i don't play a lot of shooters like competitively competitively so i think i could maybe also go with uh with a wireless one for now Again, Commander. like by now we'll see i killed the big varus the rest of yours. Excellent. I'll organize a hunt when the immediate threat of the Geth is gone. <laughs> Just pay up. I have to go. Here, for your trouble. It's not much I know, but it's all we can spare. I checked that out, uh, Coma. Thank you. Again, I haven't, like, bought a mouse in ten years, so I have no clue... How... How m modern mice even out. look. I still need the power cells for this generator, though. I found these power cells in the tunnels. Are they what you're looking for? I knew they'd turn up eventually. Here, my dad gave me some requisition money. It's all yours. Yes, please. Give me some money. It's actually a lot of money. Holy shit. The water started running not long ago. Also, uh, Paragon points. Now we just need to deal with the Geth and we can get back to growing this colony. Yeah, that's... I really like just being able to... Um... Do you have anything to say now? Oh. I was told to make my supplies available to you, if you wish. Oh, it's a merchant. Um, I really like being able to change sensitivity directly on the mouse instead of only, like, in games. Let me see what you have. Of course. I may be able to... 
Do we have something interesting? I doubt it. Unique item. Halyard Armory License. Yeah, I buy that. It's a unique item. It has a weird cost, but sure. Also, let me sell you something. Like, all of these... I don't know what supposed to be junk. Like, pretty much everything that's one or two. You've had it on your current in your last mouse and you never use it? I use it quite a bit, actually. This work must be completed. You're the commander of the ship that just landed. Actually, I'm only, I mainly used it to, like, find one setting that I love and then be happy with it. But sometimes I push it up or down, depending on the game. Goodbye. I don't really care about this character. She didn't really have anything to say that, like, interested me, I guess. Um, wait. Commander? What can I do? Oh, the man in the tunnels. There's a guy living down in the tunnels. Is he one of yours? That would be Ian. He's very sick. <laughs> no kidding. He seems to be more than just sick. He hasn't been the same since the attack. We tried to help him, but he wouldn't listen to us. I can't help my people if they won't listen, Commander. Don't you have medical supplies? Something to help him? Yeah, well, well I don't have three displays, sadly, Coma. Ian was a good man. But I'm sure it would. With us. Please, Commander. I'd prefer not to talk about it anymore. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck, Commander. Wait, what's my goal right now? Get to Exile Jenny headquarters. Okay. I guess that's uh, the elevator to the Skyway. That's true, I... I was drinking, game! I do have two displays, and they're va like, vastly different size. I mean, they're actually like the same height, but they have different aspect ratios. I also want, maybe in like, maybe after my birthday I want to get a new second monitor, because now I have the space for another 16x9 monitor. Which is actually quite nice. Yeah, the Mako! I don't know why I'm celebrating. I still want to love this thing. And now to the get base. Something an intelligent mind expects to see. Oh, I remember this. Like visually I remember this. After my birthday, I turned 21? Nah, and I wouldn't even want to be turning 21 again. Honestly, like the, the prospect of turning uh, 31 right now is way more uh, promising to me than turning 21. Um. No, it's still shooting. Fuck. <laughs> I thought I could just let it dance for a second. Oh my god, please. I just want to turn around. Like in any other game where you control a vehicle, I just want to turn around. Thank you. Gangnam Gath tank style. Nice. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> oh wait, there are way more people. I mean, people. 
I can't uh, just leave the, that juicy XP laying there. Oh my god, I just want to turn around, please. It's so difficult. Oh, I can go in there. Geth intensifies. Hello? Sirs! Um, could you? Thank you. Oh! That was way closer than I, I wanted it to be. Oh, yeah, just give me this. Nice. Heavy armor Krogan, that's pretty cool. Hey, Rex. Got something for you. Oh, it's just a straight up upgrade. That's kind of sweet. I really have new armor for me, right? Yeah. No light human armor. I'm the same guy who sang Gangnam Style? Absolutely not. Sai is a goddamn genius. You basically want the Geth to be bo uh, bored. Bored. Bo Borg? I can I can understand that. Off stream, I'm very Korean. I mean, I like to eat. Uh, bibimbap and ganjin. I probably pronounced that horribly wrong. Gangjin. The, the chili paste? I forgot. I, I, I'm not Korean. I just proved that I'm not Korean. Hello, everyone. That's close enough. Relax, Jong. They're obviously not Geth. Get back, Juliana. Who are you? What do you want? Commander Shepard. I'm here to remove your Geth problem. You see? You worry too much. And you trust too easily, Juliana. I'm just glad to see a friendly face. I thought we were the only humans left on this planet. Well, I mean, there's a whole freaking colony. By Dan and some of the members of Zoo's Hope are still alive. I thought you said they were all dead. I said they were probably all dead. They survived, but the Geth really hit them hard. We know what that's like. Those damn synthetics are relentless. Are we getting close to their base? <laughs> Borg now. Borg all. They're holed up in the Exo Jenny headquarters, just a bit further down the Skyway. Those headquarters are private property, soldier. Remove the Geth and nothing else. I'm not interested in your company secrets. Commander, before you go, my daughter, Lisbeth, she's missing. They shouldn't waste time poking around. We can do a proper accounting of our casualties after the Geth are gone. That's my daughter you're talking about. Lisbeth Baneham? I know it. Lady, you, you deserve to be attacked by the Geth. Where is your daughter, Juliana? She was working in the Exogeny building when the attacks came. Oh, yeah, there were several places she could hide. For a short time. If she's in there, I'll get her out. Thank you, Commander. Thank you. Do you know what the Geth are after? I have no idea. We certainly haven't found anything of use. Is that so? Exogeny is keen to remind us of. We need to recoup our expenses. It's nothing personal. The Borg Chicken. Tell me about the colony. We established ourselves here four years ago. Growth was steady until the attacks. Our biggest challenge has been the lack of resources. There's just so little here of value. Still, we were making a go of it. It was even starting to feel like home. What brought you here? I guess I thought this would be the start of a new life. 
I wanted to go where I could feel like I was making a difference. Instead, everything we built is destroyed. Well, that made a difference in your life, didn't it? So you got what you wanted. <laughs> where is your daughter, Juliana? Somewhere at the Exogeny headquarters, I hope. How did you get split up from the Zeus Hope colony? Most of us live closer to the Exogeny building. Zeus Hope was mostly used as a port. When the Geth hit, we scattered. Until you told us about the others, we assumed they were killed in the All right, dude. Thanks so much for dropping by. And uh, have fun running those errands. Remember to jump in on Thursday. After we finish Zelda, we start Final Fantasy V. I don't think you want to miss that. See you soon, friend. Have a good day. They're fairly secure now. Maybe you should do that. No, 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 I don't think that's a good idea. We, we have no vehicles, and the Skyway offers little protection. Like the building we're in now? Listen, our best hope is to sit tight and wait for company reinforcements. They'll come eventually. Can I just what punch the them? Used for? Oh, yeah, we repurposed that structure to serve as headquarters for Exogeny. That's mostly offices with a number of uh, light-duty R&D labs. Exogeny is a master at repurposing anything and everything. The company has to make a profit somehow, Juliana. Pharos is a long way from self-sufficient. Sure. Stay bunkered down until I find out what the Geth are after. Of course. And See, in ever. in Mass Effect One, for me, it's not that easy to uh, get Renegade points. In Mass Effect Two. I would have been able to punch this guy during this interaction like seven times and would have gotten renegade points for every single one of those punches. And I would have taken every single one of those punches. I was hoping you'd have a moment to speak with me. I've got a bit of a problem. What do you need? I need to retrieve some data. It's not a big job, but it pays well. Oh, it pays well. Sounds easy enough. What's the catch? No catch, really. It's dangerous work, but not for someone like you. You don't even Why know do people me. People always assume we enjoy putting ourselves in harm's way. It's not that bad, really. All you need to do is find my console at Exogeny headquarters and drop the data onto this OSD. It's that simple. I'll look around if I get the chance. I appreciate it. That data could be worth a lot of money. Of course, this all depends on getting out of here alive. Tell me about the data I'm getting for you plans for a few prototype mods. Ooh. I'm a freelancer. Some of my mods are highly sought after. Why work in the middle of nowhere if your skills are so useful? Damn, Maybe Shepard. I've got a bit of the frontier spirit in me. That and the alternative is a bit too secure for my liking. Freelancers don't have to worry about security as much, so long as we keep a low profile. Yeah, sure. Time to get moving. Just keep in mind what I said. This is actually a pretty long mission. I don't know if I... I don't think I will do Vermeer today. Maybe I'll do like... Maybe I keep Vermeer for the next... Uh, the next Monday. Hopefully without a freaking giant patch this time. That's just perfect. Just like when I'm driving. I mean, I can't still go there. You owe us for this. The Skyway is crawling with Geth. Package is secured. We're leaving now. Nice. Ooh, what's that? Oh, that's just a weird shadow. I thought there was something of, of worth there also. Nice half pipe. Who, who designed this? 
Like, seriously, who designed this, like, two-way with a freaking declining ramp in the middle street? Hey, dude. Protheans? Dude, Protheans must have been, like, really sick skater boys. Maybe that's why the DLC uh, companion in, in 3 is so pissed off, because he couldn't show you his, uh, his sweet kickflips. Ah. My biotics are too massive. Giggity. Some viewers tribune? Yeah, I could I could rather see that. Oh, light armor. Maybe something good? For good old Shep? It's terrible. Why would I even liberate a why is your armor garbage? Devlon industry. Why is your armor garbage? This is literally one tier down and it's better than your tier 5. It's like getting a freaking military armor made by Aldi. Wait, where the fuck am I? How the fuck am I leaving? Oh, right here. Okay. Phasmophobia, elite, dangerous, or something whole different? I don't know. All of those sound pretty fun. So. Yeah, let me do that right now. Why not? Two more points. Sure, pistols. Get those a little bit better. Oh no, my radar is jammer lambed again. What are they up to? There's no point to this unless they're looking for something. Why does he look so cool? Which one? I feel like, I feel like all of us are looking cool right now. Ow. The one with the With the exoskeleton. None of us have an exoskeleton. The Krogan I mean, yeah, obviously he looks cool. I always liked, uh, like Turians. Why are you all using a pistol, by the way? That's not right.
Turians have always been my, my favorite race, like what Garrus is. If there were a Mass Effect MMO, I would definitely play a Turian. Unless they sucked at Biotics, then I wouldn't play a Turian, because I would probably play something with Biotics. <laughs> and mechanics are usually more important to me than looks. But just like look-wise, if it were a modern RPG, they wouldn't dare uh, making some classes uh, hidden, hidden behind, um, hidden behind like a race choice, because no one does that anymore, which is a shame. Like everything, every every single character can be every single class and every single race because no one. No one has the balls to change that anymore. But because they probably wouldn't do that, so I could just be a biotic. Uh, I could just be a biotic Turian. Cry around six. Oh my god, what the fuck? I mean, I guess I could have seen that coming. Yeah, I feel like it's pretty obvious for for me. Most people would probably uh, be sure that I would play Turian, or maybe um, maybe Solarian. But actually, I feel like Turian is a pretty good pick for me. We can't scratch this field. We need another way in. Another way in. This looks like a one-way drop, Commander. Sure. I mean, it's not really a one-way drop because even I, I mean, I could climb this. Totally do Ragnite. I mean, if like the more exotic races, we can look in the journal. Uh, no, in the in the codex. If the more exotic races. Would be up for grabs. I mean, obviously. After the guess, no, not. In the early Wait, I don't have the. Ah, oh, I was going to say Hanar, but I don't have the. Uh. I don't. I don't have the codex entry for Hanar. I guess. Quarian would be. Yeah, Quarian would also be pretty good. Or an Elker. Hey, lady. Please don't shoot me. I'm so sorry. I thought you were Geth, or one of those Baron. Yeah, it would- for me it would be Turian, or maybe if, like, the- the class would not be, uh, fit- would not- would not fit my playstyle, I would probably go Quarian. You're safe now. But why were you here in the first place? It's my own fault. Sure is. Everyone else was running, and I stayed to back up data. Next thing I knew, the Geth ship latched on, and the power went out. I was trapped. I, I tried to get out, but the way was blocked. Rachni, Rachni is the, like, insect, the giant insect-like alien xenomorph-looking thing that we freed last time. We'll get you out, as soon as we find out what the Geth are after. It's not the Geth, it's the energy field they put up. They don't want anyone else getting access to the... I'm here for the Geth. It's very important I find out what I'm going to show you in, in just a second, Timmy. I don't know for certain, but I'm guessing they're here for the Thorian. What's a Thorian? You don't remember the giant spider thingy? Like <sighs> Exogeny was studying it. <laughs> Interesting. What else can you tell me? Do you know where I can find this Thorian? I, I don't remember this thing at all. The Thorian? I don't remember this at all. Do you know how we can shut it down? No, not exactly. But I think the Geth ship is powering it. I've noticed the Geth laying power cables everywhere. You could follow those cables, but there's Geth all over the place. Is that so? 
Tell me what you know about the Thorian. I really don't know that much about it. I think it's some kind of plant being Oh no, I do remember. Thousands of years ago. Oh, I remember that being like an annoying fight. Why do you think the Geth would be interested in the Thorian? It's just a plant. I don't know why the Geth would care. Exogeny was studying it, but I don't think they found anything special. I think you have to be like you have to go like up and down several ramps to go in several of those confined spaces and destroy like roots while Geth constantly keep attacking you. I, I remember that to be very annoying. Tell me about yourself. I'm just a research assistant for Exogeny. I came here with my mother. I don't even know if she made it out alive. She's with some others from the colony. She's safe for now. She's alive? Oh, thank God. I thought I was the only one left. Please, Commander, just get that field down so I can see my mother again. Yeah, yeah. You stay put. I'll go open some doors. Oh, here, take my ID. This should get you past any locked doors. Good luck with that field. Oh, I just see so many swarming geth. Oh no, it's there. Anyone else? Where the fuck is Garrus? Oh, there he is! <laughs> um, extinct races. There, yeah, those. The That's Ragni. Every species in Citadel space. Over two thousand. Wait, where do I? Okay, I think this... Wait, no. This is where I came from, I guess? It's weird that it puts you, like, in the middle of this room. Hey, Business Vulture, good to see you. How have you been, man? How was your grocery shopping? Okay, this is the right. That's the right way. I hear enemies. No, I don't want to review protocol. <laughs> it was shopping. I am unable to comply. Please contact your supervisor. Damn it! Tell me what I want, or I'll blast your virtual ass into actual dust. Sexy. Please contact your supervisor for a level four security exemption, or make an appointment with. Stupid machine! If there is nothing else, please step aside. There is a queue forming behind you for the use of this console. <laughs> oh, there's a queue forming for my butt! Heal, you moron! No! I knew he would do it. I knew he would just come and slap me. No, I don't want to review protocol. I am yeah. Hello? I couldn't just do I couldn't do anything. I just dropped. No! <laughs> Please! Stop it! No, I don't want to review protocol. Yeah, me neither. I am unable to Stupid. If there is nothing else. Okay, this time I freaking finally at least dodged his Rocket. Oh my god. 
very scary again. He just needs to run into my face and punch me. Exogeny Corporation reminds all staff that the discharging of weapons while on company property is strictly forbidden. Welcome back, research assistant Elizabeth Bainham. What can I do for you? Yes, I am indeed her. User attempting to access. Fetching data. The previous user was attempting to access details on the study of subject species 37, the Thorian. Tell me everything you told the Krogan. I was unable to provide the previous user with any relevant data. Aside from lacking proper access, there has been no new data available on Species 37. All sensors monitoring the observation post at Zoo's Hope have been enacted for several cycles. Uh, what? What does Zoo's Hope have to do with the Thorian? Species 37 is located within the substructure of the Zoo's Hope outpost. Tell me everything you know about the Thorian. The Thorian is a simple plant life form that exhibits a sentient behavior uncommon with other flora. Oh. Through dispersion and the eventual inhalation of spores, it can affect and control other organisms, including humans. The Zoo's Hope Control Group has yielded interesting results. Before sensors went offline, almost 85% of all test subjects were infected. Awesome! <laughs> Are you saying Exogeny knew its people were getting infected? It was deemed necessary to assess the true potential of Species 37. That's why they were acting so strange. You should contact Joker. Joker. Come in, Joker. Damn it. That field's blocking us. We've got to drop that shield and get back to the outpost. B.I., what can you tell me about the Geth ship and the field it's generating? I have limited data on the Geth. They have effectively blocked all sensors within the facility. Of course they have. I have detected unusual power fluctuations, but am unable to determine the source. We need to find that ship. Let's get moving. Going to standby mode. Boodoom. Freaking VR troopers over here. Upper level, upper level. Exogeny approach. I just love playing a biotic so much. I actually, I actually like physically moved. I like physically jumped. Looks like they're using these claws to enter that ship and circle the building. The Geth don't waste much in messing with land things. How do we cut the power if it's coming from the ship? Why are the voice lines so quiet? It's still the same. It's only this mission. This is before you get biotic combos. Yeah, that's what I said I think in the first time, uh, in the first stream I played this. I very vividly remember doing like singularity and warp. Or maybe singularity and throw and that being like a combo, but I, I, I think that was added in Mass Effect 2. I mean, they had to do something for, like, getting rid of two-thirds of the skill tree. This place seems almost peaceful. I think the Geth were using this room as some kind of religious temple. Whatever. I need you to learn their code. Also, both of them are combos. I probably used, um... Um... I probably use Singularity Warp more. I use Warp way more than... What's it called? I use Singularity way more than... Uh, I use Warp way more than... Throw. I don't know why I couldn't think of the word throw. Oh, I should do this. It's just straight up have an app upgrade for him or maybe this actually yeah let's go with this oh 
Oh, well, I don't like this. No! There we go. Yeah, I also I I beginning I'm beginning to remember more of this mission. I think I already remember the last fight. Um Oh hey guys. I wanted to do something but I forgot I had cooldown. I'm so very afraid of just getting yapped in the face by one of these guys like this one! Fuck off, sir! Please die, thank you. How do I... <laughs> I'm too dumb to get over this. Ha! Technology. Never trust a Krogan running up to you at speed. I mean, I guess you should trust him because you absolutely know what he's about to do next. He's just going to fucking yam you in the face with his elbow. For like eight million damage. Ah, oh, this is his uh, the dude's data, or data, I guess, if you are from a different part of the world. God damn it! Could you land in a more convenient spot, please? Oh, I have to, <laughs> I have to wait for my cooldown. Whoop him up? I don't even know how to whoop. I've only done that like once this entire playthrough. Let me actually check that out. That probably is going to be like somewhat helpful in the future. Melee is F. Does this work? Oh, it does. I mean, somewhat. Not really. Let's just go with the trusted method. Oh my god! I'm getting smushed! <laughs> Please! My head! Okay, it worked. <laughs> that was so dumb. Where am I supposed to go, by the way? Shuttle bay door controls, okay. <laughs> oh, that was so stupid. Wait, now I'm here again. Oh, that's where... I yeah, that's where I came from there. Did I go? Wait, yeah, I did go up here. That's the freaking VI, right? Was here? No, it, no, it wasn't. Oh, another light armor. Actually, two light armors for me to check out.
why are all of them so much worse? Like, why is the scorpion armor uh, obviously the best armor? I mean, this is kind of cool. Better shield, same damage protection, but less tech and biotic protection. Yeah, I take most of my damage from just like regular projectiles. Oh, that doesn't, that doesn't look so hot though. I don't like the looks of this! Confidential. The test samples were due to arrive three days ago, but we haven't heard anything from the colony or the cargo vessel. We suspect the samples... I said... Here I said samples, and here I said samples. God damn it. Became volatile and recommend cutting off all further contact with the not a crooks colony. Even if the colony is discovered, no one should be able to trace the events there back to us. Huh. Neat. Do you not, like, have to break the claws of the ship? Oh, yeah. This claw is identical to the last. We'll have to keep going. We have to find one that's, like, somewhat broken already, I think. And then we can kick that off. Shambles, yeah. Nice beat. Oh, that's just a dude standing right there, huh? Sniper! I'm so afraid of the snipers. The sniper's knee. There we go. I actually didn't remember that the missions are so long in this game. I really like that. I actually really like that the missions take time. Oh, hard decryption. Let's check it out. Nah, that's not so hard. Geth invasion. According to data retrieved from this console, the Geth are preparing for a major offensive in Citadel space. If this information is accurate, they're amassing a significant force somewhere in the Armstrong Nebula. Or oh, I'm just slow. That's... that. You know what? I also enjoy that. You thought you had me, but I just barged on through. Wait, no. No. Oh my god, it's... No, I'm sucking. Yes. <laughs> Private log of Dr... Gam Gamoral? Gamoral. I don't trust this Cerberus group. They may pay us well, but if this gets out before we are develop we've developed an antidote, it's just not smart. They won't tell us what they want the samples for or why they wanted them delivered to the Matano system. My records show nothing of interest out there. Ah, Cerberus already mentioned. That's pretty cool, actually. You find a repair ticket attached to the console. The damn door to the shuttle bay is fried again. Works fine if the PSI is 30 or lower, and the safety shutoff kicks in if the PSI gets above 34. But if the PSI is in the 31 to 34 zone, the door slams down with enough power to shear through a metal I-beam. 
Somebody fix this before one of my team loses an arm in that thing. Yeah, let's just... Wait, what? Who told you to go down? I can give you a little bit of 17 and... A little bit of 7. A little bit of 5. And I fucked up. <laughs> Wait, 31 to 34. There we go. Bye, bitch. Have a nice drop. Exceptional command. That's still a cool cutscene. We can go deal with this Thorian creature now. Oh God, do I want to deal with that? My kind of mission: kill a bunch of guests and end things off with a huge crash. Huge crash. Keep your guard up. There still might be a few geth inside the base. I repeat, Normandy to shore party. Are you reading? Anyone there? Normandy to shore party. Come on, Commander. Talk to me. Is that you, Joker? What's going on over there? We're in lockdown here, Commander. Something happened to the colonists. They're banging on the hull, trying to claw their way inside the ship. They're freaking out. They can't do any real damage. We're on our way back. Just hold your position. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, we'll just wait right here for you, Commander. This place will be crawling with Geth in a minute. Keep together and we'll get out of here in one piece. Yeah. Sure, whatever. Ooh, hello. Think you could hide from me? Ow, ow. Oh. Okay, I guess we just go back now. Oh, this thing is- yeah, obviously that thing- that thing's still here. Fucking Garrus fell in front of me, I think. Ah, uh, whoops. Actually, it's it's actually bothering me. Let's go back to my uh my old armor. It's actually bothering me how this one looks. Yeah, it's definitely a struggle. Rex getting some more barrier and Garrus getting max decryption. It is, I mean, it's definitely a lot about the looks. Oh no, I'm here again. I'm in the hell zone again. I didn't even want to go here. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I have to go here. There you are. I think we should get out of here. I don't think this place is safe. I need some answers. You knew more about the Thorian than you let on. I... I was afraid. I wanted to stop the tests, but they threatened me. Told me I'd be next. Oh. When the Geth yeah. attacked, I stayed behind to send a message to Colonial Affairs. I tried to tell them where to find the Thorian, but the power cut before I could send the message. I... I never meant for this to happen. Where's the Thorian? 
The Thorian is underneath Zeus Hope, but the entrance is blocked. Mass Effect Fashionary Edition. Just before we get attacked. But why are the Geth after the Thorian? What could Saren want with it? Well, it does have unique mind control capabilities. That's what Exogeny was interested in. Storming into shore party, come in. What is it, Joker? We're getting a lot of Geth comp shatter. Looks like they're headed your way. Thanks for the heads up, Joker. You heard the man. Let's move out. We need an armor add-on. I would take that. I might be able to help. Undo the mess I helped create. Sure. I guess I don't have a say in this. I would have rescued her anyway. I'm not a dick. Back to Mameko. Getting in more of a mess, oh. Please, just, please just let me, please just let me turn. Like a normal, like a normal vehicle in a normal driving game. Sadly, I guess driving over them doesn't do damage. Driving over them and just just rolling them over would be a lot of fun. Oh, also another level up. This, driving around with a Mako is just handing out, um, it's just handing out level ups. Boost! I think like speedrunning when when speedrunning Mass Effect I would actually be most afraid of the Mako sections. I don't know how it is in the in the Mass Effect speedrunning community. I haven't watched the Mass Effect speedrun so long. Is there anyone picking this up? Wait, what? All right. What was that all about? This is Juliana Bain of a Pharaoh's colony. Please help us. You don't think you've ever seen this Mass Effect speedrun? That I thought they were very fun. Like a lot of it's a lot of out of bounds. But I actually quite enjoyed it. I watched one they're usually around an hour, I think. I watched one I think like ADGQ two years ago by now. You can't do this, John. <laughs> Everyone shut up. Uh, let me think. What's going on? You won't get away with this. Get her out of here! Get away from her, you son of a bitch! Lisbeth! Damn it! Come, come out where I can see you! All of you! <sighs> Shepard. Damn it. I knew it was too much to hope the Geth would kill you. I found some interesting facts about you in the Exogeny database. I know what happened on a cruise. This doesn't have to end like that. What do you think you're doing, John? Communications are back up. Exogeny wants this place purged. This is a human colony, John. You can't just repurpose us. Ah! It's not just you. There's something here far more valuable than a few colonists. Are you gonna tell them about the Thorian? Or should I? The what? It's a telepathic life form living under Zeus Hope. It's taking control of the colonists there. Exogeny knew all along. You won't get away with this, John. So you keep saying, but nobody's gonna miss a few colonists. Oh, I, I'm not good or bad enough. 
You've gone way too far. This ends now. If, if that's the way it has to be, heck, come on, come on! Fuck me. Wow, well, they stood down real fast. We're shooting each other in the back. <laughs> it's my fault. Actually, I shot him in the face. I knew what was going on, and I didn't do anything. Don't you start. You do good work, and you know it. So what now, Commander? I need to find out why the Geth are after the Thorian. The colonists won't let you near the Thorian. They die first. They're under its control. How do you know? I thought you only learned about it, like, right now. What else am I supposed to do? There's gotta be another way. I know that I need like a lot of paragon there points you could say before Vermeer. I know colonists. I remember that. Like a gas grenade. Releasing clouds of nerve gas doesn't seem like a particularly good idea. It's not like it's weapons grade. The insecticide we use in the grow labs contains trace amounts of tetraclopine, a neuromuscular degenerator. Sounds if their tasty. Systems are already weakened. It may act as a paralyzing agent. If we must consider it, drop it in a concussion grenade. Sounds good. I'll do what I can. Excellent. Thank you so much, Commander. Equip your grenades with the anti-Thorian gas upgrade. Sure. Yeah, that's that was my plan anyway. Um, headshot. I know, I, it's because I, I remember it from uh, my first playthrough. I know you can lose Rex. If you don't, like, talk him out of uh, his aggression. I remember that, and I know that you needed a lot of points. But how things are going uh, today, we're probably going to finish this mission anyway and then stop for the night. These Monday streams... Uh, Mako, please. Please! Okay. I kinda made it through. There we go. Um, these Monday streams, just because when I have to work on Monday, I'm just home at like 9, they always are going to be... <laughs> way way shorter than my other streams, so I I guess you and I both just have to uh, To live with these streams being only like two hours two and a half hours tops uh, Even though I would love to stream longer. I just hate that I Get home so late But hey, I'm I mean if I I hope that my job application that I'm writing on Thursday Maybe it leads to a change in that, because if I would get that job, I would just get a stand standard 9 to 5 job and I would be able to stream way more freely in the evening. Even when I have work on a specific day. I don't like how that... Yeah, how that guy's just posed there. I was about to say something. Get in the tank. Get in the tank. Why are we not standing in the tank? Oh wait, I have the grenade. Guys, don't! Don't! Oh, maybe. Maybe do. What was that green? Fucking hell. It certainly wasn't human. God bless actual 9 to 5s. Preach, headshot. Preach. Speaking of jobs, you applied to a job at IKEA the other day. Ah, oh, that sounds kind of nice, actually. I want to control it absolutely. No hitting the colonists, even if the Thorian makes them fire on us. That's what the gas grenades are for. Very well, Commander. Let's go. Um, probably right now, actually. I can detonate grenades after throwing them. <sighs> Oh my god. Wait. Are these not supposed to be colonists? Am I just wasting my grenades? 
No, okay, those are colors. Hey, hey guys. There we go. I just wasted my grenades. Well. Oh. As a visual merchandiser, so you use like CAD and stuff and organize stores and product in this place. That sounds kind of cool. I only have one grenade left. Oh, hey guys. How did I not get her? Just take me. Just take me. Lady, please. You are incredibly incompetent. Lady, please. There we go. I mean, I don't think I can even, like, actually... Actually do this now, because I absolutely wasted my grenades. What was happening there? I only got one... Oh, wait! Now just... Now just... That's how it has to be. I guess I fished them out. At least I got one. It was stuck on the dude's head and he acted like a shield for her? What a goddamn hero. I mean, I guess we can see if I find grenades somewhere. Oh. Let me just do a little bit of this action. Oh, upgrade kit. Maybe grenades. Yes, grenades. Oh, come on. There we go. No, I wolf! I threw two. I'm so bad at this. I wanted to detonate the first one. Which one of you is... Not... None of... Exactly none of you is the name one. There she is. God damn it. I even had to throw two because they were just not standing, like, standing far apart from each other again. I suck so much at this. I need more grenades. Hey, Macadoyle, please, I need more grenades. Let me just... There's crane controls. There's a thing called the ground where you can throw grenades on. I mean, come on, let's not overcomplicate things. Any more? Any more? 
Nope, I guess this is it. Let's just... No! Yeah, let's just... I fucked up so much. Let's just do this. Let's just do this over. Yeah, I threw away so many grenades. Sir? Where the fuck are you going? Okay. Hey, guys. I also remember that I hate the last fight of this mission. The last fight of this mission. I've like somewhat vividly remember that. There we go. Please! Please! No, why he killed so many? You take back. Come on, guys. Fucking assholes. While I was picking up their grenade, they sniped like three of them in the head. Actually, right now, just just stay here. It would actually be helpful if you just stayed here at this time. Okay? Okay. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Wait. Oh, maybe there are more... If I'm lucky, there are more grenades here. I don't think so, but, you know... Better safe than sorry. Oh! Actually, oh, there actually is some stuff here. Just not what I what I need. Actually, I did get one grenade. Yeah, I did get one grenade. That actually makes it easier to get the the next few grenades. Okay, guys, please, I need you here. Please promise me to stay here for once. Can I do something on this here? No. Options. Gameplay. Squad power usage. Well, I guess that's as good as it goes. Hey, Jeremiah, good to see you. You join in to see me struggling. Let's just get these three people in here. Yeah? Uh, quote unquote people. Oh, 
dude was like smashed against the ceiling. Okay, and a level up. Finally of work, congrats, man. Fucking hell. Fucking hell! I have to look where the freaking number five is. Let's just do it from the menu. How did I not get every single one? Oh, because that guy was just behind someone. Please! Please! How did I not get that? He was immediately next to him! I- this is my last try. If I don't get them all, I'm just going to flick and flip and flick. They were right next to one another and it didn't count. It only counted for one of them. Like with these two. They're directly next to one another, so I'm going to do this. Okay, this time it worked. Fucking hell. The first can be a shield. Yeah, f fuck off. That's very annoying. Let's just clear as much as possible from these creepers before we get any of the actual like colonists. Classic meat shield. Yeah, they're so. St I mean, they're like the strongest meat shield ever. Okay, red. Red, how you took that in the face, Rex. Please? That was incredibly loud and close. Oh, hey. Hey, guys. Party around here, I guess. This is this is like a lesson for life. I suffer because I want to be a good person. If I were just like a dick bag, this would have been way easier. Do something, please! <laughs> Actually true, yeah. Yeah, obviously. There's a colonist. There's Hannah Murakimi. They're so f they're so far spread apart, though. Can I push her? Fucking, I threw the last one again. Because I was mashing. Okay, fuck off. You had your chance. Just die. Sorry, man. I can't move. Sorry, you had your chance. Fuck off. You ran away. Your own fault. I say 14. It's probably worth jack shit because it's just like, hey, either you save them all or you don't save or you don't save them all. I tried to fight it, but it gets in your head. You can't imagine the pain. Headshot? I don't care. <laughs> These people trust me. It wants me to stop you. There we go. Wait, how and where do I go now?
Um. Did it bug out on me? Am I not supposed to use this this thing? This control panel? Oh no, this is where you go. This is where I go. Yeah, I, I used it already. I just thought the, the freighter would move. Like the the um basically the car that was parked there. Yeah. Okay, I got 28. I got 28 uh, Paragon points. That's that's pretty good. I have a lot of Paragon points, but now I have over half. That's a lie. <laughs> I have close to half. The game showed me what had moved. I was too busy being pissed about wasting grenades. Yep, there it is. I do remember it. Hello, sir? All right, we just need to find this creature and determine what it... What... It, this was not covered by my training manual. Yeah, same, yeah, actually. <laughs> we are going to need bigger guns. I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Thorian. It commands that you be in awe. Um, I'm not in awe. You gave something to Saren. Something I need. Saren's oh, guns. Yeah, gone. that actually makes more the sense. But the uns 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 was still there. The first time in the long cycle, trades were made. Then cold ones began killing the flesh that would tend the next cycle. Flesh fairly given. The old growth sees the air you push as lies. It will listen no more. I won't let you keep your thralls. Release them, now. No more will the Thorian listen to those that scurry. Your lives are short, but have gone on too long. Your blood will be Oh, hey, dude. Command. Again, I vividly remember hating this fight. I used the automatic med gel again. I still don't know why that sometimes happens. I I didn't I didn't trigger it. Uh, sir, please. Also, why are you using a pistol, Garrus? Uh, 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 Rex. Yeah, the automatic mad gel is very annoying. Oh my god, that thing. That hurt. I can tell. A few more of those and it's in trouble. 
Actually, I can. you can save in between the nodes. At least these ones. That makes it somewhat more tolerable. Hey oh Yeah, that's usually how it goes. Just, hey, everything's very loud, but we're doing very important exposition. Okay, bye. Hey, dude. Oh, Garrus is dead again. Just a quick weapon locker trip. No big deal. Can we get a little bit of this? Ooh, Stinger 6. Is that not what I'm using? Only like 5? No, I'm using... Oh, I am! Yes, that's just straight up better. Try to hide the least logical story bit. And some Deus Ex Machina. Ah, I mean... You can't prove that. See, Garrus, if you don't use a fucking pistol, things are better. Just listen to me and don't use a pistol. Like this. Oh, hey, 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 lady, please. Oh my god, fucking hell. Garrus with the sniper rifle is actually a fucking menace. Yeah, scientific theories are things that are actually really well proven. It's why you often hear, like, um, creationists being like, bah, 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 evolution is only a theory. And they're like, yeah, it's a theory because we have, like, a lot of proof to back it up. Otherwise, it would not be a theory. It wouldn't even make it to theory status. Gravity is a theory. Actually, multiple theories. Depending on- uh, hi guys. Depending on which model you're currently- currently most happy to use. But I mean, I'm not- I'm not trying to sound like an expert on- on that matter, specifically when there's a freaking astro, actual astrophysicist in my chat, I can I can only like I can only embarrass myself. Oh, thank you, medical station. Please. Oh, light arm, another light armor, and another heavy armor for Krogans. Less shield, more damage. Ah, but not that much damage protection. How does it look, though? It looks absolutely horrible. Please get it out of my face. What did I get? 
Phoenix 5. That's also terrible. Why is the Scorpion 4 just the best armor? I dislike this greatly. <laughs> Get out of my face, ugly armor! Exactly. Then YouTube and Twitter philosophy PhD students. Aw, oh, man. Sometimes I wish I would have stuck with the philosophy... Uh, with studying philosophy. Just so I could be one of those guys. And troll the ever-living shit out of you. Oh, hey guys. You... you waiting for something? Oh! Actually, this fight is not nearly as bad as I remember it being. I remember that every single time after you destroy a node, this Asari clone would just, like, kick my ass. And I'm pretty sure I played on the same difficulty. I definitely play did not play it on the hardest difficulty. When I played this game on the first time, I was not that, that into hard difficulties. That only came later. Maybe you couldn't quick save in the original fight. I don't remember that being able to quick save. The fight is still really long, but I I mean I can just quick save in between. I don't remember that being the case in the original. I mean this to scourge out my control scheme for the landing vehicle in Elite Dangerous another day. Just not enough energy and motivation, hello sir! Oh, hi! Oh, hi, actually, everyone. Okay, now it's actually a bad situation. Yeah. I mean, I pretty much saved immediately beforehand, but... Did they come from... Did some of them come from behind? No, not really, right? It's just down there. I know you guys are going to get up. Just do it. But yeah, this fight is definitely really, really long. Oh, 
Oh man, Garrus is just wrecking shop here. Oh, hello. Fucking hell. Hi, guys. This time I didn't even see the- oh, there she is. There we go. Yeah, oh. it's so freaking pulsating. Hello, hello, lady. Oh my god, the freaking snipe! Die. There we go. That's it. And goodbye, sir. I'm free. I... I suppose I should thank you for releasing me. That would be nice. <laughs> Is everything all right? Are you hurt? I am fine, or I will be in time. My name is Shiala. I serve, I, I served Matriarch Benezia. When she allied herself with Saren, so did I. Well, Benezia foresaw the influence Saren would have. She joined him to guide him down a gentler path. But Saren is compelling. Benezia lost her way. Are you saying Saren can control minds? Benezia underestimated Saren, as I did. We came to believe in his cause and his goals. The strength of his influence is mm, His strength. She tried to manipulate Saren, but in the end, her plan backfired. Asari matriarchs are among the most intelligent and powerful beings in the galaxy. How could one fall under Saren's control? Saren has a vessel. An enormous warship unlike anything I've ever seen. He calls it Sovereign. It can dominate the minds of his followers. They become indoctrinated to Saren's will. The process is subtle. It can take days, weeks, but in the end, it is absolute. I was a willing slave when Saren brought me to this world. He needed my biotics to communicate with the Thorian to learn its secrets. Saren offered me in trade. I was sacrificed to secure an alliance between Saren and the Thorian. Then why were the Geth trying to destroy the Thorian? After Saren had what he needed, the Thorian became a liability. Yeah. Saren knows you are searching for the conduit. He knows you are following his steps. He attacked the Thorian so you could not gain the cipher. What's the cipher? And why did Saren need it? The beacon on Eden Prime gave you visions. But the visions are unclear, confusing. True. They were meant for a Prothean mind. To truly comprehend them, you must think like a Prothean. He must understand their culture, their history, their very existence. The Thorian was here long before the Protheans built this city. It watched and studied them. When they died, it consumed They built this city. They became a part of it. They built this city on Thorian. What? So the Thorian taught Saren to think like a Prothean. How? The cipher is the very essence of being a Prothean. It cannot be described or explained. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> it would be like describing color to a creature without eyes. To understand, you must have access to endemic ancestral memory. It sounds gross. Spanning thousands of Prothean generations. I sensed this ancestral memory, the cipher, when I melded with the Thorian. 
our identities merged, our minds intertwined. Such knowledge cannot be taught. It simply exists. I need the cipher. There is a way. I can transfer the knowledge from my mind to yours, as I did with Saren. Gross. Try to relax, Commander. Slow, deep breaths. Let go of your physical shell. Reach out to grasp. <laughs> the the squinty eyes are so bad. <laughs> Every action sends ripples across the galaxy. Every idea must touch another mind to live. Each emotion must mark another's spirit. We are all connected. Every living being united in a single glorious existence. Open yourself to the universe, Commander. Embrace eternity. Honestly, so far it wasn't that much clearer. Oh my god, her eyes are also pretty squinty. <laughs> I have given you the cipher, just as it was given to Saren. The ancestral memories of the Protheans are a part of you now. Are you all right? What just happened? I saw... something. It still didn't make any sense. You have been given a great gift. The experience of an entire people. It will take time for your mind to process this information. We should get you back to the ship, Commander. Medical needs to know about this. I am sorry if you have suffered, but there was no other way. You needed the Cypher. In time, it will help you understand the vision from the beacon. I do have to say that I really love the vision and the film behind it. I mean, I'm pretty sure that a lot of it is, uh, like, actually filmed. It's not computer graphics. And it's actually really well made. I, that was something that definitely struck me as pretty awesome the first time i played that and i still i still really enjoy just watching the the different images flicker by is there anything else you can tell me about the thorian when the creature enveloped me i became part of it but i still don't truly understand it so alien so ancient its exact age is impossible to know it measured time differently 10,000 years of hibernation a Vulcan mind melt yeah frantic pretty much of activity its mind was awesome magnificent it transcended all classification and now it is gone yeah I, I did that <laughs> the meat on the PCB is mostly filmed apart from the part where it's flowing over a PCB that flows the CGI effect yeah and um a lot of like the cables that are going on there, I think, is like that's actually filmed. Like most of the technical parts in it. Don't tell me you feel sorry for that thing. The Thorian was a unique life form, a sentient being that lived for fifty thousand years, maybe more. There is nothing even remotely like it in the known galaxy. I am grateful you saved me from a life of thraldom. Yet I cannot help but feel some sorrow for the loss of such a rare and remarkable creature. What else can you tell me about Saren? There is little I could tell you that you do not already know. He's powerful. He's, he's charismatic, charismatic. And he's sexy. And he is dangerous. Oh, that too. Once I followed him, blind to his true nature. But now I see he's leading the galaxy into an age of darkness and suffering. Now that you're free of the Thorian... What are you planning to do next? If you allow it, I would like to stay here with the colonists. They have sure. suffered greatly, and I played a role in their suffering. I would like to make amends. The colonists will need all the help they can get. They'll be happy to have you on their side. Thank you, Commander. May fortune smile upon you. And to you. You did it. With the Thorian gone, we can start rebuilding for ourselves again. And we're free of yeah, the remaining 14 colonists. 
there were no more. I mean, there's not even evidence that there were more than 14. I I only counted 14. I I don't know what what you guys are talking about. It was 14 colonies. It was they called it the 14 colony. Pretty much. Uh, the entire thing was just like woven around the number 14. It's pretty strange actually. Thank you, Commander. Hey, you finding my workstation out in the ruins? I immediately forgot about you. I was there anyway. It was the least I could do. Well, I appreciate it. Here, you certainly earned this. I certainly Thanks did. Again, oh my god, that's actually a shit ton of money. Okay, let's go to the ship and do the... I never thought uh. I would be... Forgive my previous oh, sorry. Action. Under the Thorian's influence, every thought was examined and filtered. Yeah, that's fine. I wish you well in your future efforts. Um. Oh, I killed her. Whoops. Let's go to the ship and do the post mission. Like, briefing. And then I'll stop for the night. This actually took way longer than I anticipated. We only did this mission, and it's a two and a half hour stream. Just the power grid girl. Yeah, I only killed her and the nameless colonist. I mean, I I mean, I I didn't kill anyone. I I don't know what you're talking about. Is I only counted 14 people? I don't know what, where where you got that information from. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in <laughs> they never even had a power grid girl. Power grid girl, is that not the uh, the show on Cartoon Network? Suffering any ill effects from the cipher. I just need some time to let this cipher do its thing. I might be able to help you. I am an expert on the Protheans. If I join my consciousness to yours, maybe we can make some sense of it. Oh, power! Po I mean, I almost right, almost. Almost power grid girl. Do it. Hurry. We don't have much time. Ah. Now I get to with Liara. Embrace eternity. Like that opening mouth is so cool. And I think that's just on in front of the camera. Incredible. All this time, all my research, yet I... I never dreamed. I am sorry. The images were so vivid. I never imagined the experience would be so... intense. You are remarkably strong-willed, Commander. What you have been through, what you have seen, would have destroyed a lesser mind. Thank you. Come on, get to the point. What did you see? Fuck you. The beacon on Eden Prime must have been badly damaged. Large I hate Ashley so much. Are, ...are missing. The data transferred into the commander's mind is incomplete. You sure you didn't come across any kind of clue or hint? Something we might have missed? Everything I saw, you already know. You were right about the Reapers. The Protheans were destroyed by a race of sentient machines. I think it is obvious there is a connection between the Reapers, the Prothean extinction, and the Conduit. But I did not see anything that would help us find it. What's our next move? I was able to interpret the data relayed through your vision. What was there, at least. Mm. But something was missing. Saren must have the missing information. Maybe he found another beacon. If we can find the missing data from your vision, I can... I can... Oh. I am sorry. The joining is exhausting. I should go to the medical bay and lie down for a moment. Dr. Chakwas should take a look at you. That's just That's what this, she said, but okay. I just need some rest. Somewhere quiet. Tired, bad. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Dismissed. I sent off the Pharos report, Commander. You want me to patch it through to the council? Yes, please. Patch him through. I'm a good specter. Setting up the link now, Commander. 
Commander, Exogenia should have told us about the Thorian. It would have made your job much easier. Agreed. You might have been able to capture it for study instead of destroying it. The Thorian liked to enslave minds. Anyone who studied it would have ended up as one of its thralls. Perhaps it's for the best, then. At least the colony was saved. Of course it was saved. Shepard would go to any lengths to help a human colony. Good night, Simmy. I mean, we're only just doing this dialogue and then we're ending the stream anyway, so you're not missing out on anything. Hope to see you soon, and have a good night. Being human had nothing to do with it. They were in trouble. Admirable. But sometimes Spectres have to make sacrifices. I hope you're willing to do that when the time comes. Foreshadowing. We will be waiting for your next report. Okay. Let's quickly save. And then unquickly save for real. Yes. There we go. Okay, yeah, this is where I'm going to stop it for the night. Wow, we only did pharaohs. Uh, I honestly anticipated doing more. Maybe like some side content again. But that was actually like as long as I wanted to stream. That was a long ass mission. Um, next Monday we do a whole bunch of side stuff. Maybe give the Citadel another, another visit. We haven't been there for like since the first time I streamed this, I think. And then maybe we're going to Vermeer. Depending on how much we get done next next time. On Thursday, we finish Zelda Link to the Past. It's only the last dungeon and the last fight left. And then we jump immediately into Final Fantasy V. Which will be hype. I'm looking forward to starting that game again. Get out of here, Mass Effect. Yeah. Thank you all so much for watching, uh, even though it's like a later and shorter stream. Thank you so much for being here. Really appreciate it. Stay safe, everyone. Stay healthy and hope to see you on Thursday. Bye-bye.